Hello, today we're going to make a comic graphic in Microsoft Word. It's quite straightforward but it does show you how layers work and how you can get some quite good effects without buying any extra super software to go with it. Here we are in Word. First things first, we're going to put the background in. So up to the insert menu here and we're going to pick shapes. I'm going to choose from the stars and banners an explosion and drag it out. It comes up with blue and this is going to be our background shadow layer so we're going to recolor it straight away in grey. I'm not totally happy with the shape of it so I'll just adjust that round a bit and I can even turn it round if I wasn't happy at all with it. I'm going to copy and paste that to get a second copy of it now. And on my second copy, it's going to have some nice bright colours because it's at the front of our graphic. To make it look like it's a bit more in front of our shadow, I'm going to add some special effects, shape effects to that. And so I'm going to have some soft edges to it. I'm going to have some glow around the outside I'm going to have a glow yellow as if I've actually done it with a marker pen and I'm still going to add a little bit of shadow to it as well so there's some shadow at the same time so I've got shadow and glow and there we have my graphic all but ready for my text to go on. So I insert now again and this time I'm going to go for word art. Straightforward bit of word art and I'm going to put in there awesome control A to select all that text because now I'm going to make it a bit bigger so it stands out on my graphic move it over there so you can see it for me. I don't think very much of this typeface so back to the home menu and I'm going to type in here a different typeface. I've selected AR car to which I have but you can pick whatever you have on your system. To give it a bit more jiggly jiggly I'm going to change some of the sizes of some of the letters so they do vary a bit and that gives it a bit more comic-y feel. You could have it zooming in and zooming out and gradually getting bigger and smaller with the letters. And finally just to break it up a bit more I'm going to spin it round with that top handle there. But we're nearly there. It would be nice to have it just jump out a bit so on the font menu there's an A with a blue surround and this gives us those same effects we saw earlier on. So I'm going to give it a, a blue glow to go around the outside and in fact I'm going to change the text from black to another blue itself. So now we've got some awesome text standing out there. It looks like it's been spray painted on there. I'm not so happy with that blue so Let's just make it a bit darker. You can change it as many times as you like. Thanks very much for watching.